We are in San Jose, California at Display Week 2015, and I have with me Mr. Dongcheng Li, who is Chairman, Founder, and CEO of TCL Corporation. Mr. Li, in terms of the supply chain for the display industry, mm. what is China's major role in terms of end users, components, and that sort of thing? Past 10 years, uh, Chinese industry has uh, put a lot of money for display in industry. Uh, for example, uh, in the past five years, all the newly uh, LCD, 8.5 generation LCD production lines mm -hmm. are all built in China. Oh. Uh, uh, from since the 2008, uh, all the new uh, 8.5 generation uh, LCD production line mm -hmm. are built in China. Uh, have six uh, built from Chinese enterprises. Another two uh, from Samsung and LG. Uh, they are set up their own factory in China. Uh, that means it's a huge money input to this industry. Another side, uh, China is a la a biggest uh, TV manufacturer uh, country and also is a, a mobile phone manufacturer country. Mm -hmm. About 60% uh, 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 TV made in China and 80% uh, smartphones uh, made in China. Uh, so see. China become the uh, global manufacturing center <laughs> for TVs and mobile phones. Uh, that means Chinese market have a huge need for uh, display panels. Uh, so last uh, past a few years, uh, more large panels such as 8.5 uh, generation LCD panel factories and the small size uh, AMOLED, uh, LTPS, uh, IGZO uh, has been built in China. I see. Mr. Li, what factors have led to China's amazing success in the display industry? I think it's uh, uh, three factors uh, support the uh, uh, China display industry uh, develop so fast. One uh, is uh, money. Uh, this industry needs a huge uh, money invest. Mm -hmm. uh, in the past uh, five years, Total the investment, I think maybe uh, over twenty billion uh, dollars. Twenty billion dollars. Yeah, in this industry, uh, including the large panels and small panels, uh, and this in China the new newly built factories are the uh, most uh, innovation the production line. Mm -hmm. So it need more the money. Yes. Uh, second, uh, this the China industry and the market, uh, the need, the the China market for TVs for mobile phones is a very really huge. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe TV uh, in the Chinese market local about uh, uh, fifty million uh, set per year. For smartphones. Uh, uh, Last year is a 423 million uh, unit. Mm -hmm. So it's a huge the market demand. Mm -hmm. From uh, China itself. From China, uh, in mm -hmm. internal. Uh, so this the support the uh, market demand. Uh, another size, the, for China industry, uh, we have the, we have the rising our technology. Uh, in the before uh, five years ago, uh, we just uh, fallen the uh, the follow up the other international uh, companies, including including the Korea, Japan, and the Taiwan China. Mm -hmm. Now the is a difference. Uh, Chinese company the put our source in the developed technology, including the patents. I see. For example, for TCL, in the past 
five years, we have applied. Uh, we have applied over seven thousand patents on innovation on display industry. Mm -hmm. So Chinese company the for tech technology area uh, developed so far so, uh, so fast. Uh, so this is four uh, factor uh, support uh, uh, China display industry uh, going fast. I see. Thank you. <coughs> what challenges does the Chinese display industry face right now? Uh, yes, I think it's a big challenge from the uh, technology. Mm -hmm. uh, display technology develop uh, very fast. Uh, we, we can, can uh, we, we can see in the past uh, uh, ten years, the this market developed very fast. At the same time, technology evolved uh, also fast. Too. Also fast. Again. Yeah, we for all the uh, players, including the Chinese company, must uh, uh, get up the f uh, fast. Uh, for technology earlier, mm -hmm. uh, in the before the for LCD, uh, we transfer from TN to the uh, IPS mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. PVA. Uh, uh, the TFT, uh, TFT technology transfer from the uh, amorphous silicon to the LTPS mm -hmm. and. And the ICDO is another option. Uh, we just develop the next generation technology. For example, uh, just I speak the, today, the painted display technology. Yes. Uh, we, we think uh, they will be the next generation technology. Mm -hmm. Because the uh, because currents, the all that uh, technology for large, for large uh, panels, mm -hmm. including the uh, evacuum evaluation uh, technology, uh, evacuum the evaluation facilities, that's very uh, expensive. It's expensive. Uh, the, the more the material consumption and the low the production yield. So the price is so high. Mm -hmm. I show the picture. You can see uh, it's the same the size for UDTV. Mm -hmm. Price the uh, price indicators is a one. The OLED is a three point nine. Really? Uh, three point nine is a very, very, very high the price. Yeah. So I think the uh, painted display technology maybe is a n new generation for large size display products. Mm -hmm. uh, that means that we put uh, many sourcing, yeah. many sourcing, many effort in the new uh, technology development. Mm -hmm. So I think the biggest challenge for technology, technology de de uh, develop we need to uh, put uh, more money. Uh, most important, we, ma we, we, uh, we need the choice to collect the te technology direction. How <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's, that's, that's uh, very, very important. It is. Yeah. Direction is a uh, right. Mm -hmm. Doesn't mean that you that put the any sourcing, including the money, can get the good result. That's right. Okay. That's right. Yeah. This is a problem yes. everyone faces. Really. Yes. All right, Mr. Lee. Well, uh, last but not least, do you have advice for companies outside of China who would like to do business with display companies in China? Uh, the global uh, display in industry for the integrate, integrate, uh, we need more uh, cooperation uh, between between the uh, different countries, uh, different companies. For integration. Uh, for integration. Uh -huh. So I think the uh, have a more opportunity uh, in China for foreign company uh, uh, invest the uh, display in industry. 
uh, of course, for the display industry, if you manufacture the uh, panel, mm -hmm. doesn't need a huge money. Mm -hmm. But except the panel uh, manufacturing, we have developed uh, more newly uh, materials and parties. Mm -hmm. uh, these uh, materials uh, parties from the different the uh, country, uh, a, a different company, mm -hmm. and the different country. So, uh, for example, uh, for TCL quantum dot backlight technology, mm -hmm. we use one the American company uh, technology. I see. Uh, they are develop quantum dot backlight the technology. Mm -hmm. the, four years ago, I met their CEO in the U.S. Yes. So I, I, I just, we look, this, this technology is very nice. Mm -hmm. So we're discussing the cooperation. Now uh, our product uh, is already available in the market. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a good response from the Chinese market. Yes. I'm confident maybe a response a bit, a bit uh, in the global market. So I think the uh, cooperation is the uh, most important. Mm -hmm. uh, we are already uh, cooperation with the uh, uh, partners worldwide mm -hmm. yeah. uh, developed uh, uh, current te uh, technology and application and future technology uh, new generations I see. so so th uh, this meeting SDI uh, meeting I for me I have the meet the many peoples uh, discussing uh, cooperation opportunities. I see, I yeah. see. So Display Week is a great place for you yes. to meet potential new partners and clients yes. and learn about new technology. Yes. Great. Well, yeah. Mr. Lee, thank you so much for sharing with us your insights about the Chinese display industry. Okay. And uh, we thank you. Okay. This is Display Week 2015 in San Jose. Okay.